Then you're gonna wanna keep it clicked. Go to simulate or simulations, whatever version you're using. Dynamics. Um, connector. Then, then you're gonna wanna select the cylinder, your tire. Here, I'm gonna rename that. Tire body. Just to be a bit more organized. Yeah, okay, so what you're gonna to wanna to do now is select the tire and the connector. So shift click, or you can just drag and just shift click on both of them. Shift click, shift click. Um, then you're gonna to wanna to go into character, commands, reset PR. Don't worry, I know I moved down here. It's what it's supposed to do. But then, now you're gonna to wanna to grab them both. And you're gonna to wanna to group into this null object, which I'm gonna rename into tire R B for actually B R back right tire or right yeah tire back right just so I know which tire it is. I'm gonna position the wheel where I wanted to, or you are too. I'm going to rotate it 90 degrees, so shift and rotate, move it, rotate, let's see, it's not even that complicated, but uh, Cinema 40 has made it really simple to do this kind of stuff. Then you're going to select the connector, and under object A, you're going to want to click on, I think it was a body. And for object B, it is going to be the tile, tire, not tile, tire, or the wheel, whatever you call it. Next, you're gonna to want to click the body and the tire or the wheel, wherever, and give them dynamic tags. So, shift click, shift click, right click, simulation tags, rigid body. Um, now you're gonna to want to just take it to your tire, tier not not tier but tire. Click. Connector, not hinge. Wheel suspension. I was wondering. I knew there was something wrong. Not what I really want. Connector is wheel suspension. I rotate that. Okay. Rotate in 90 degrees. There we go. I think I'm just going to move this down a bit. I'm going to move it right there. Okay, yeah, so you can see that works. Um, I'm going to make this invisible because I don't really want to see it right now. I don't need it. Yeah, then you're going to copy, paste, paste, paste. I like having everything in order. So yeah, uh, you know what? Never mind. Just to make this quicker, not gonna do that. You're gonna see. I'm gonna rotate this. It's on the opposite side. I don't know if that makes a difference. Probably should know that. Boom. Move this one up here. Now that I'm really looking at my pickup, it looks really stupid. But I don't really care. And just to make sure that these things are lined up, I'm gonna take this one.
I'll rotate it. And position it right there. I need the coordinates. So for Z, it's that. I like having things kind of symmetrical. Kind of helps in the long run. Yeah, okay, it seems to be working. My mouse doesn't, but suspensions do. Uh, click play. They are all sticking to the pickup. Cool. Reset. Let's see, what else do we need to do? Make the floor, I've already done that. Right, if you want your suspensions to be, so like right now if I click play, it just falls, right? So you're going to want to go to your connectors, object, your stiffness, maybe put up to like 10. I think I have about 15 in my video. Getting better. 20. I'm going to now I'm going to keep this 10 increase this to 50. Or not. I have a feeling I'm doing something wrong. Let's see, let's see. 0, 0, 10, 50. Okay, yeah, let's make this 50 and that 50 and see what happens. Now it's just bouncing up and down. Okay. 20. Yeah, you know, let's just go with it. You guys can tweak, tweak, and tweak until it's perfect. I don't need perfection right now. <laughs> 